Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So I have another story time video because I know how much you guys love these story time videos. So this one's gonna be back when I was six years old. Um, this happened back in like 1996. So here we go. So it was me and my grandma and my aunt. My mom was traveling because she would travel a lot whenever I was younger so I remember going outside we had a retired bucking bronco named mage his show name was magic but we changed his name to mage um, so I went outside and we have this like field where we put our hay for our horses and that's where our horses would like eat hay and everything. So I went out there one day and I thought to myself, hey, why don't I braid Mage's tail? So I hop over the fence and I remember we had this like metal fence and I remember going up behind Mage. He didn't know I was behind him because horses can only see like out of their, like, in front of them. They can't see behind them. So I, re I remember going up to his tail because I wanted to try to see if I could braid his tail. So I start braiding his tail, and I think he finally realized that I was braiding his tail, and he didn't like that. So he's like, I'm gonna, ki I'm gonna kick this bitch and send her flying. Mind you, I was only six years old. So I go flying backwards after he kicks me and he kicked me in like the abdomen area. So I go flying backwards. I remember the side of my cheek hitting like a tree branch, like a pretty sharp tree branch. And I just remember lying, laying there screaming and I think I screamed loud enough to where my grandma heard me in the house. So she comes running out and so does my aunt. And my grandma calls 911 and the paramedics came and they walked over to me and they're like, hey, where does it hurt? And I said, my, my tummy area. And so he checks me over I remember going into the ambulance and going into the hospital was probably the scariest part just because I was young and I didn't know what was happening because of the shock. So I think my adrenaline my adren adrenaline uh, kicked in and I felt like a burning sensation on the side of my cheek because I guess I had a really big scratch mark from the tree and I remember the nurses cleaning it out and I just like screamed at the top of my lungs because it hurt so bad um so I remember my aunt calling my mom because my mom was in Florida on a business trip and I remember my aunt telling me that after she called my mom, my mom was like swearing on the phone, like, how could you F and do this to your, to my daughter, blah, blah, blah. And I think she was just upset at the situation. She wasn't upset at my aunt at all, but I mean, it's still a scary situation because I was, I was six years old. So I was still like fairly young. So I remember I had a lacerated liver. That's what the nurses told me. So I had to stay like five days in the hospital. Um, but I remember the paramedics came and visited me. It was so sweet. I still remember to this day that they visited me and seeing if I was okay, which I was. And I remember my mom came and then two of my aunts came and they took shifts on and off. So my mom would watch me 
one night and then they she would switch off with my other aunt and my aunt would watch me and they just go back and forth um, and then after my hospital visit was done I was able to go home I was on restrictions like I couldn't like rough house um, because they didn't want me like re-injuring my liver and I'm surprised I didn't have a scar after the tree branch like scratched my face so that was probably one of the scariest experiences I've ever had in my whole entire life um, so I learned my lesson never to get behind a horse without him knowing you're there and braid his tail. I mean, I was, I was just a kid, so I didn't know what would happen, but there were consequences. So I never did that again. Um, but I don't know what I was thinking. So yeah, um, I'm okay. I'm all better. I'm all healed. So that's basically all I want to say for this story time. <laughs> Let me know if you guys have any scary experiences. Um, if you would kindly share them in the comments below and I would love to know because I'm, I'm nosy like that. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. Uh, please like this video and subscribe and make sure to hit that notification bell for whenever I upload new videos. Uh, thank you guys and have a great day. Bye.